By the end of this video, you will be able to add your character to your Roblox game using Roblox Studio. Let's get started. So let's say you want to add your avatar to your game using Roblox Studio. The easiest way to do this is to pull up Roblox Studio and then go up to the top and click on Avatar. And then you're going to actually click on Rig Builder. And it's going to ask you to generate a rig. You can do an R15 or an R6 and in any shape, masculine or feminine. But right here, you can just click my avatar. And as soon as you click that, it added my character avatar to Roblox Studio in this game. And if you would like to change anything about your avatar in the game, you can go up to home and then select the avatar, the rig, and you can click on move or scale or rotate. So I'm going to rotate this so it faces the front. And you can edit your avatar by clicking it and then going to the right hand side on the Explorer and under rig, you can rename that whatever you would like to rename it. You can change anything about your avatar. And so if you would like to remove anything uh, from it, maybe uh, the shirt or the face or the hair, you can go ahead and remove that here. So that's the easiest way to get your avatar into your Roblox game. If you would like to get any other character in your Roblox game, the easiest way to do that is to go up to plugins. So to have another character added to your game, you want to use a plugin called Load Character or Load Character Pro. And if you don't have that installed, you can go to your toolbox and then click on plugins. And then when you click on plugins, you can search for load character. And you'll see there are several options. The Load Character Pro is currently 100 Robux. And then there's also a load character light. Load character light will work. So I have load character light here. So I just click on that and it will bring up load character. And basically you just type in the name of the user that you would like to add. So I'm just gonna look for me again. So Roblox learner three. And there I am the same exact avatar. And you can either have it spawn at the origin or you can unclick that and it'll spawn anywhere in your map. Hopefully somewhere you can see it. And let's say I wanna do an R6 this time. And there I am. So I was able to add another avatar and I added the same one, but th this way you could load any other avatar besides yourself. So you now know how to add characters within Roblox Studio. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. If you made it this far, you might also be interested in how to insert any catalog item into your Roblox game. I have another video that covers this and I'll put a link to it here.